Sylvian trick of the week. Today, Hannah is with me helping us out. And we're uh, broadcasting from DC Dance Collective. Check it out on the web for the classes that they offer. I also teach classes here. So we're going to jump right into the new intermediate pattern. We're going to show it to you, demonstrate it, and then we're going to break it down. All right? All right. Five, six, seven, and one, two, three. Five, six, seven, and one, two, three. Five, six, seven, 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 one. Five, six, seven, and one, two, three, six, seven. So this is the pattern, and let's look at it slowly so everybody can understand. All right. The way this pattern starts is with an inside crossbody leap. We've done this before, so we're going to rotate the lady inside with our left hand jump. So in order for her to understand that this is an inside turn, we need to keep the lead low. All right. So we're not lifting the hand up. Here. So let's do the first three counts. One, two, three. So this is it, you're keeping it here. And on five, six, seven, I'm just going to give her direction and I'm going to turn her inside. And five, six, seven. So as you can see on seven, as soon as I see her back, I'm basically placing my right hand on her shoulder blade right here. And I can give her additional support with my left hand and put my left hand on, on her back if I choose to. Or you can just keep on holding uh, to her head. Alright, so I'm going to uh, put both my hands on her back. And I'm going to step forward. I'm going to make a step forward with my left as she's dipping back. And I'm providing support for her back. It's very important because you don't want the lady to hurt her back, right? So we're going to step back, lady, to step back with your right foot. You can do one. Two and three. Alright, one more time just to dip and one, two, three. And I'm gonna lead her out. She's gonna turn uh, this way, she's, she's gonna turn around her uh, right shoulder and five, six, seven. So what it is here is basically I'm just gonna show the gentleman uh, the dip uh, alone. So the forward, you step forward with your left, you're providing support and supporting her back. One, two, and three. So on three, you want her up, and you're gonna rotate her this way. So I'm basically rotating to her to my right. And five, six, seven. Once I give her the direction of rotation, I let go, and she's gonna complete her turn on her own. So ladies, for your dip, once you're here, the guy has your back, right? He's gonna dip you back. What you wanna do is Keep your back straight so you don't want to lean back like that, you're going to hurt your back, right? So you keep your body straight, you, you go back with your left, with your right foot, one, two, and on three, you step slightly forward and then you rotate this way, five, six, and seven, okay? One more time from the top, and one, two, three, five, six, seven, and back, two, and five, six, seven, and you ask for her head. Okay, so from here, the second part starts with a drop catch, and we've done the drop catch, so we're going to review it again. We lift her head up on three. One, two, three, rotate her to her right. Five, six, seven. Gentlemen, at the same time, we rotate. We've done this before, so you can review that video. Place her head on our shoulder on seven. I'm going to step forward and she steps back, her head uh, slides on my shoulder. And one, two, three. And from here I'm going to turn her inside, five, six, seven. Now the difference here is that I keep that lean low and I give her rotation all the way until she, her back is uh, towards me. Right? So let's do that one more time. Ready? And one, Two, up, five, six, seven, and one, two, three. I keep that lead low and I rotate her inside but low. Five, six, seven. Okay? So here you can choose to put your head on her shoulder. Again, we've done the drop catch, so this is, uh, I'm sorry, the shoulder check. This is the shoulder check footwork. Gentlemen, you're basically stepping in place, so you're doing one, two, three. So left, right, left. The ladies are going to shoulder check footwork, which means they're going to step with their right on one, two, and on three I'm going to ask her to turn and face me. And I'm going to give her one more rotation, five, six, 
six, seven. Okay, so there's two turns. Uh, from here, we're going to go into a copa, but before that, let's go over a few more details. Again, the drop catch. One, two, three, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, five, six, seven. Now, you see here, Hannah is nicely holding her right arm above my, uh, my, uh, holding my arm here so that she doesn't get trapped. What you don't want to do is get trapped like that. Okay, ladies, it's not free, and it's not going to allow me to lead the next move. Okay, so you always, always want to try and keep your uh, hand above the lead. Okay, so one more time. And one, two, three, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, five, six, seven, and one, two, three, and five, six, seven. So, gentlemen, the lead here is basically happening from her hip. So here, let's rotate this way. I'm going to hold her hip like that. I'm going to give her the direction of uh, and she's going to be moving back. I'm going to step back into my back break. I'm going to go into a single hand call. And one, two, three. Stop her here by, by her hip. And five, six, seven. And I put my hand on her shoulder blade as soon as I see it. I'm going to go into a cross body and I'm going to put her hand over my head. One, Five, six, seven. All right. So we're gonna look at that one more time. I'm gonna try it with music. Ready? And one, two, three, five, six, seven. And back to three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. And one, two, three, five, six, seven. One, two, three, five, six, seven. One. Two,